Yo, hello everyone. Are you looking to streamline your accounting process on your WooCommerce store? In this video, I will demonstrate how to integrate Xero, a popular accounting software, with your WooCommerce setup, from connecting Xero to your WooCommerce and installing the plugin. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. The first thing that I will need you guys to do is of course, launch your WooCommerce store. Right after that, make sure to go to the plugin section on your WordPress website and click on add new. From here, you have two options. Either upload the plugin from this button and choose in a file from your PC or searching for the plugin. Let me show you how to upload plugin. You can click simply on a new tab and search for Xero WooCommerce plugin. And here it is. As you may notice, you will really have to pay for it to get it. It will cost you around $8.25 per month or $99 per year. What's included in this pack? You will receive one year extension updates, one year support, and 30 day money back guaranteed. And the details and compatibility, it will work with 1.7.57 uh, version of the latest, like the latest version of WordPress or WooCommerce. And it will help you a lot in the process of your payments. So now how we can really add it? Simply, once you buy it, you will receive a file. The next thing to do is click on choose a file and click here and drop it. It is as simple as that. The second method, which is by searching for the plugin. Click here at zero and wait. Just wait for it until it loads and here we go. So here, Invoice Getaway for WooCommerce Invoice Payment Getaway. This is the one that we are looking for. Now, this is a free version of it, so it doesn't have all the abilities and compatibilities that you are looking for. And this one is not really the one that you are looking for, so don't go for it. Now, let's click on Activate. And now we are on the plugin section. Make sure it is activated once more by going to here, Getaway for WooCommerce, and here it is. So provide an invoice getaway for WooCommerce so your customers can check out without immediate payments. Now, if you want to hear and you want for extensions, you might find some WooCommerce extensions about Xero as well. So in case you didn't find them in the in the like plugin section, you can simply go here and search for Xero. So let's search for Xero here. And as you can see, here it is. Here, save time with automated sync between WooCommerce and your Xero account. So this one will help you a lot to add it through your WordPress website. So it will take you directly to the marketplace where you can actually buy it. Now, what does Xero actually give you? Well, Xero for WooCommerce give you the ability to set up automatic creation of invoices in Xero for e-commerce sales. After the module is installed and conf configured each order placed in your WooCommerce store, is securely sent to your Xero account to keep records up to date. Our products, shipping, discount, and tax data is sent to Xero. So when payments are made, they are applied to the appropriate invoice to keep everything in balance. So invoices will be made automatically once there is a shipping, order, discount, uh, products added, anything that has been done on your store will be directly sent to your Xero account to be stored in there and everything else they said is gonna be in balance. Now, how can you open an account on Xero? Simply if you clicked here and opened it in a new tab, all you have to do is click, for example, on try Xero for free. And here, all you have to do is fill these informations by using your first name, last name, email, phone, and location. Then check this too, I'm not a robot, and then confirmation. That's all you have to do. And let me show you how the dashboard is gonna look like on your Xero account. So here it is guys, and this is how it looks like. This is the dashboard that you will have once you open your own Xero account. Here, you find all your Xero account details. For example, if you have connected it to your WordPress or WooCommerce account, you will have to add a new organization. And this organization have to be named by your WooCommerce name, add your website, etc. So for example, here I'm going to add a WooCommerce store. 
e-commerce search in from list uh, let's do WooCommerce here okay here yeah, I'm going to choose this one keep it like that I'm not a robot the last day of finish year it's December and then click here to start the trial and let's give it some time until it creates our business or organization and here it is the dashboard so now anything that will be happening in my localhost which is my WordPress store everything is gonna be sent to here from invoices payments tracking where the money is going and the visibility over our cash flow you can even manage our employees stay on top of your taxes track time and costs on your job explore apps connect with Xero everything will be sent to you here so everything will be clear detailed in here for you you can even get the premium version of Xero in here to have more than these options you can even open this video that has 2.6 seconds to explain to you more about how to use this application so each one of these of course will have to be set up alone so for example here to get your cash flow details you'll have to connect your bank account that has been connected to your WooCommerce store the same goes for here to create here and customize your first invoice so this is how you can create invoices for example there is something different about how works your account was accessed so for me I have to verify my account here you can just verify it real quick um, go to Gmail account like that here we go check my zero support confirm login and here we go okay the login was trusted so now if I refresh so this is how the invoices are actually gonna look like it is very easy to use guys here to whom you want to send it so you have to put here the email the invoice number due date reference here the payment uh, currency you can choose add currency through here and add for example USD and you can see here here it is accept currency here you can add you can even check uh, like the transaction how much one euro is cost uh, per USD so it exchange rate is actually updated every day so you have everything in details and simply next thing what you do is put here the items that you are selling description etc but this is only for the normal users for the premium users who has their zero connected to the WooCommerce store this will be actually filled automatically the amount the account discount unit price quantity description the item name everything will be created for you for no like f without you touching the keyboard it will be created automatically all you have to do is click on preview and you will see literally everything that has been sold or created on your woocommerce store and yeah guys that was it for today's video thank you a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial